Hi, right, welcome to Super Amazing Project. Today, we are joined by the one, the only, Mark. Hello. This is Mark, and we are outdoors, and we have lovely uh, Amanda's Daily U t-shirts. Because they're going to get messy and dirty, and we don't care about <laughs> Amanda. As we are approaching April Fool's Day, one of the greatest days in the history of mankind and prankdom, uh, Ashton Kutcher's birthday, we are going to be doing uh, some pranks. So Mark, why don't you take us through your prank? My favorite kind of prank is the kind of prank that just ruins someone else's moment, and, and it is the filling an Oreo with toothpaste. So you take a couple Oreos, you've got to start you gotta start strong, as you probably did in elementary school when you're like, oh, this cookie nonsense, get it out of the way, all I want is the frosting. So we scrape out the frosting. You can eat that later on your own time. Not now, internet. Uh, and you're also, if the cookie breaks, that's okay because the toothpaste will hold it together. Toothpaste, there's a whole variety of them. You have to make sure you get a white toothpaste. Plain white. You squirt in the middle, not too much, but just enough to cover kind of a glob right. if you want to do. Right, so yeah. Really and then you just put it, see like so, Smooch it around and put it back together. A little, a little dab will do ya, Look at as that. they say. Look, that's nice. So this one's pretty, pretty solid. Uh, and we put them back in here. Yes. The big sell here, the secret, is that you have to be holding, enjoying, and eating an Oreo when whoever you want to prank comes in. But right, this was like a legitimate Oreo. Oreo. It's like, oh, I'm engaging you. How was lunch? Stops, up, down, left, right. Who are you talking to? Oh, no! It's our whoopers. Mm -hmm. Wow. It's got hoop paste. Yeah. Hoop paste. Hoop paste. Awesome. Well, there you go. Very good. I like that Oreo prank. Thank you, Mark. How's the toothpaste Oreo? Um, clean and dirty yeah. all at once. Oh. All right. Well, the other prank we have is one of YouTube's favorites, mm -hmm. and that is, of course, the Mentos in the Coke. There is a way to set it up so that when someone opens the Coke bottle, it pops in as they open it. We have to do this very carefully. All right, so you get, you get your thread like this. You get a nice long piece, so I'll cut you a bit, Mark. There you go. I take a needle. We spend half the video just trying to thread the needle. Mm -hmm. Nothing makes more entertaining television. Yeah, got it. You got it. Basically, what we're gonna do is we're gonna poke a hole right in the middle of this mento. Ow! And not stab yourself Good. with the needle. I think you just have to approach the mento like your enemy. Maybe wear a thimble. In fact, yeah, you actually use a thimble, thimble would not just for Monopoly anymore. Oh, yeah, that one went into my skin. Yep, I, I had that happen. The needle just... <laughs> so, yeah, if you use, uh, in a caveman fashion, something to hammer the, the needle into the mento... This is a video you know, where some... we hammer nails into mento <laughs> with toothpaste. Welcome. <laughs> oh, this is this is much more effective than the toothpaste. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> What's funny is that the prank is definitely on us. Uh, <laughs> this is all an elaborate ruse. It's like watching an egg oh, like hatch. Oh, oh, the miracle of birth. You guys. <laughs> yes. I've earned my keep. Success. <laughs> okay, there we go. All right, so here we have the wonderful, majestic mentor on a string. You gotta put it over there like that, right? And yeah. now I want you, Mark. Mm. This is possibly a two-person job. You this is really, as you can tell, at tie, least two people tie, and maybe uh, a box of tools. Let's put that on. Cut off the excess string. We have a, we have the coke here. It is prepped and ready. Uh, one thing you do not want to do once you've done this: don't start picking it up and being like, "Hey, <laughs> man, who wants a coke?" Because it's gonna obviously fly up into the mento and then the eggs on your face. So we go. Oh, hey guys! Oh, hey, like, hey can you, you open that? Open that coke? Yeah. Oh, look, did you see that cute puppy video? I did. Our grumpy cat's latest. Uh, oh! oh! What a great April Fools! April Fools! That must have taken you so long to do, <laughs> and it was totally worth it. Yeah, <laughs> my right hand is sticky. <laughs> there you go, Amanda. Eat Coke. All right. Well, thank you so much for watching. Uh, have a great April Fool's Day. Have fun with toothpaste, Oreos, and Mento Coke. Try not to stab your own thumb with the needle. And if you try anything based on what we did, feel free to to give us response videos. We'd love to see your plans in action. Thumbs up for the needle for the Mento needle. The yeah. needle. <laughs> the next year's greatest prank. Death by Mento. Bye. Bye. So how are you? You know, we haven't talked about you at all, and I'm just thinking about you. I broke the needle. You broke.